So here you can see her moving her eyes around, moving her mouth around, and these we're actually going to use to create a photoreal digital character. So if you take a look at these scans that we have of Emily, you can see that the human face does an enormous amount of amazing things as it goes into different facial expressions. You can see things, um, not only the base shape changes, but all sorts of different skin buckling and skin wrinkling occurs. You can see that uh, the skin pore structure changes enormously from stretched skin pores uh, to the regular skin texture. You can see the furrows in the brow and how the microstructure changes there. You can see muscles pulling down at flesh to bring her eyebrows down, or muscles bulging in her forehead when she winces like that. And in addition to this kind of high resolution geometry, since it's all captured with cameras, we get a great texture map to use for the face. And by looking at how the different color channels of the illumination, the red and the green and the blue, diffuse the light differently, we can come up with a way of shading the skin in the computer that instead of looking like a plaster mannequin, actually looks like it's made out of living human flesh. And this is what we used to give to the company Image Metrics to create a rigged digital version of Emily. We're just seeing the coarse scale geometry here, but they basically created a digital puppet of her where you can pull on these various strings and it actually moves her face in ways that are completely consistent with the scans that we took. In addition to the coarse scale geometry, they also used all of that detail to create a set of what are called displacement maps that animate as well. These are the displacement maps here and you can see those different wrinkles actually show up as she animates. So the next process was then to animate her. We actually used one of her own performances to provide the source data. So by analyzing this video with computer vision techniques, they were able to drive the facial rig with the computer generated performance. So what you're going to see now after this is a completely photoreal digital face. We can turn the volume up a little bit if that's available. Image Metrics is a markerless performance driven animation company. We specialize in high quality facial animation for video games and films. Image Metrics is a markerless performance driven animation company. We specialize in high quality facial animation for video games and films. So if we break that down into layers, here's that diffuse component we saw on the first slide. Here's the specular component animating. You can see all the wrinkles happening there. And there's the underlying wireframe mesh. And that's Emily herself. Now, where are we going with this here? We've actually gone and build, gone a little bit before beyond light stage five. This is light stage six, and we're looking at taking this technology and applying it to whole human bodies. This is Bruce Lahman, one of our researchers in the group, who graciously agreed to get captured running in the light stage. And let's take a look at a computer generated version of Bruce running in a new environment. And thank you very much.